I'm very slow and quiet. Hmm. Must have been rats. How repulsive. Yes. Quick. I do hear footsteps still. Yeah, somebody's coming. It's another noble woman. else okay. gonna eat some cheese yum, yum. <gasps> nothing up there anything here what's this oh a book master guest list Dorcas Goodfellow in attendance Lord Bafford in attendance whoa Lord Bafford is here nice I hope you remember who that was he, like, was the first mission in Thief 1, and he also is constantly mentioned in other missions, often as a running gag of some sort, which I guess this is also. Madame Dinye, Dinye, declined invitation, pagan, sim, pagan sympathizer, Lord Gervasius in attendance, Ramirez, no response. Ramirez was also mentioned in Thief 1, we, um, took some revenge on him because he tried to assassinate us. Sir Christopher in attendance. Marie Eleonora in attendance. Archduke Damar in attendance. Pernilius Pennybuckle esk what does that mean? In attendance. Master Willy in attendance, but quietly escorted off tower grounds. Wanton drunkenness. Duchess Alexandra Kurinov in attendance. Lady Louisa in attendance. Squire Shauna's decline, touring with the city's rom rumpleball league whatever that is. Lady Fun Vernon in attendance. Jossa Fieldstone in attendance. The Bumblesons. Winifred and Archibald in attendance. Thistlewell in attendance. Evelda Ravencourt in attendance. Well, lots of people here. The Rothschilds, Frederick and Penelope. No response. Misplaced invitation? Question mark. Sir McAllister Crom in attendance. Brandy Ridge. Madame Robillard. Both in attendance, Lord Carlisle Sol in attendance, but retired early. Lord and Lady Rumford. Oh, okay, in attendance. Um, I'm trying to remember where did they? Lord and Lady Rumford. They appeared in some mission too. Can't remember right now. Sir Allard McCrellis in attendance. Bandley Rofthofer declined on holiday in Shalebridge. Huh. All right. Interesting. Rumford, Rumford. What was that again? It rings a bell. Look but the source of that shit. Servant. <laughs> shit. Was surely just moss in mine eyes. <laughs> See if someone is there. Jesus, they sound so creepy. You say anything else? Jeez. <laughs> it's kind of creepy also how they laugh when you knock them out. Almost as if they're happy that you just, well, made their constant pain and agony go away or something like that. Um, you know what I mean? <gasps> Just water. This is like kitchen or something, so I think we're close to the dining room then. Dining hall. Brethren, the guard on the office door shall be changed upon every three hours. Isn't that? Oh, that's the text we already read somewhere else. I see. Some nice music again. Don't think I've been here yet. This is a bit dark. 
nothing of value, but there is a box here. Oh, and look at that. It's nothing. <coughs> look, I threw it so hard, <laughs> it's stuck in the wall. Nice. Got some more money. We're gonna have so much money in the next mission. That's really cool. Okay, I see. This leads back here. That's good to know as well. Oh, well, there's somebody walking here. But they are going in the opposite direction. I'm just a closet. Super dark. Anything hidden in here? Oh, look at that. Look at that. Oh, yeah. How cool is that? Trigger control for wall save alarm? I don't even know what that is, but I'm glad I found this. Wall save. Now I'm stuck. What the hell? I'm stuck. Oh, no. Okay. I don't know, just got stuck for some reason. No, I want this to be off. I wanted this. Oh, jeez. Good. Can I actually hear? Someone is there, nice. then show thyself. <coughs> Thanks for the key. Might have also, could have also ignored him, but it just feels so good knocking them out, I have to admit. Speaking of keys, I keep unlocking the doors with my lockpicks, but I actually found some keys in here. Maybe they work? They do. What's this? I was afraid for a second that the floor was very loud, but it's not. A fucking maze. I put it on the bed because that makes less sound, less noise, I mean. Okay, nothing else here, I guess. Interesting wall, but yeah, okay, okay. Just a room with a big mace. Which is a bit odd, considering it was locked. You'd expect something of value, but... Oh well. What's this? There's another key. Number three. Okay, so it's a key I already have. Is this the wall save? Good lord, the noise in here is so loud. I can hardly hear if I'm doing anything. I... Nice. Wait. I wanted to read that, thank you. The new scripture of the Master Builder, draft, page 35. This is like... Um, we learned about that a few episodes ago, I think. That Karras is actually like trying to like kind of rewrite the, the Hammerites Bible. And like write his own edition or something like that. The new scripture of the master builder. The builder smiled on the things Karis had done, and of course he like betrays himself as the the absolute messiahs. The builder smiled on the things Karis had done. Out of devotion he had invented many machines, and these machines now served him well. He had transformed wretched humans into agents of the builder's will, controlled directly by the influence of Karis's machines. These were called servants, and they had been embraced by those in the city who considered themselves superior because of the wealth of the coffers instead of the spirits. These same people had beamed at Karen's with one face, but with another face smirked amongst each other and shared affronts. For this Karen's had once detested them. 
but he saw now their role in the builder's plan. In all these things, Karras had forged the tools that he would use to bring the builder's paradise to the world. The builder looked upon these tools as Karras made preparations to put them to use, and his gaze showed favor, and Karras felt the builder's hands upon him, and the builder's strength helping Karras carry his burdens. Thanks for sure. This Karras guy has lost his mind. Yeah. So too. Even potion. Thanks. What the fuck? What the fuck is that? What the? Where are you? You you. You look really weird. Yeah, run away. Please. What the f let's, let's just go the other way. Don't want to know what that Who's is. Who's making those noises? That would be me. Bink. Another key. Carlisle Armory key. Oh. Huh. Remember at the beginning? Of the mission when we were using the rooftops, there was an armory and I didn't have a key to access it. On our way back... Wow. Who made that noise? That was me. <coughs> oh, don't fall into the fire. That's gonna kill you. Okay. Here, take a nap. Um, on our way back, because we have to go back anyway, I, if I find it again, I will try to open it. Because now I'm really... I was already curious what's in there anyway. What, what am I going to do about this guy? This Someone might... Is there, then show thyself. Hmm. Just moss in mine eyes. I have a noisemaker arrow, but that's going to turn him... Well, that's going to make him alarmed. It's not so cool. What if I... I could just use this. I mean, that's quite easy. For I love... sake, stop thy flutterings and... <laughs> <laughs> Stop that fluttering and oh. Good. You can snuggle with this guy. Have fun. Okay. But I'm not gonna go there yet, because I think this might be Karis's office. And I wanna do that last. First I need to find all recordings. I'm still looking for the dining hall, actually. I'm gonna leave all doors open now, so I know which one I, I opened and which one I didn't. I usually don't do that, but this place is a bit confusing. So... Yeah, no, not you. I might have to go there. Let's run. Run, 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 run. Okay. Huh. Maybe the dining hall is in this on the sixth floor? Where the ball room is as well? Because I couldn't see any dining hall here. I think I entered all the rooms on this floor. Didn't I? Yeah, I did. I'm pretty sure I did. Or did I? It's here. The stairs. Okay, let's take the stairs. What's this? Oh, okay. Light. This is the ballroom. I 
have to be careful because the floor is very loud. Message number six of six. It is here that our evening ends. Enjoy being the music and dance if thou wilt. On the morrow, when thou dost return home, your servant will be waiting for thee. Yeah? They travel on their own. Indeed, on occasion, they will leave your homes in response to a device I call the Guiding Beacon and return to us for but small adjustments. Upon their return to your homes, better servants they'll be. I apologize yet again for my absence tonight, noble friends. Fare thee well. Still very bright here though. Huh. I'm going to try the other way. I'm a bit concerned because I still haven't found the dining hall. And I, I think I've checked everything, haven't I? Well, we'll see. I'll just keep looking. Hmm. Can I get over here <laughs> without them noticing? <laughs> Who made that noise? Nobody. I guess it's nothing. These old buildings make too much noise. Is someone there? No. Who do I invite? Who do I invite? I found him! He's over! Get him! <laughs> Shit. Okay. I'm here. Come here. Now for you, I have this. Shit. Another round. Quick. 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 Come on. Yes. Yes, it worked. Finally, it's not easy. Of course, this could have gone better, but whatever. Okay, I'm I'm a bit confused now because I don't know where the dining hall is. Let's just check again. I'm actually, going to go to the ground floor. Although uh, I don't think there's anything on the ground floor. This is so loud. Really, this doesn't look like there's a, a dining hall here. Quick look here. That's just the entrance. Karis, steal my nerves. For hold! In Karis' name, hold! <laughs> Thanks. I wanted these. Okay, now back up. Um, yeah, let's just go by process of elimination, I guess. Um, that was the, the ground floor, the first floor, I mean. And there was no dining hall there. Let's have another look at the next floor. I still think it should be on the fifth floor, to be honest, because there were like there was a kitchen and all. And I don't. Did we find a recording machine on the fifth floor? I don't think so. No. Come on, I want the fifth floor. Gonna have another look here. Hmm. Oh shit. That thing is still here. 
Maybe it is behind that one locked door. You know, the one that I assume is Karis's office. What if that is not Karis's office? Although then the question would remain, where is Karis's office? I think that is his office. Let's just find out and break in. This leads back to the stairs, okay. This was another room. Wait, did I check all the doors in this room? Yeah, okay. I did. <laughs> okay, do we have a key for this? No. Huh. Then, how do you open this? I'm an idiot. How did I... How did I miss this? This is the freaking dining hall. Jeez. There we go. Message number four of six. Privilege get... Privilege get... Privilege get... Privilege get... Privilege get... I trust you will enjoy this feast. Presented by the servants I have given you. Imagine, a short while ago these servants were consigned to an asylum. Mentally feeble. They were of no use to anyone. Now they are safe and productive. Now they know happiness. Would that I could be with you tonight for the servants make excellent cooks. After you dine, friend Vilnia will guide the arm to the gallery. Hmm. Okay. Of course, that still leaves the question of... Where to find... The key... To this. I knocked out one guy earlier. Where did I put him again? I think I put him into that bedroom. Where was that? Not here. Oh, I'm so terrible at remembering what is where. Here? Did he have a key? No, not really. Oh. Sometimes you can open doors with a fire arrow. Sometimes you can. Maybe a mine? That will blow myself up. <laughs> See? Hmm. office. Okay, I'm just gonna look. I'm just gonna look around until I find something. Actually, there's one thing I haven't checked. Usually I knock guards out and then I can see if they have something, but I shot a gas arrow at this one. Yeah. Oh, Jesus Christ. Of course. It was indeed that. Ah. 
Like, I knock out almost everybody in this mission, and the only person, the one person I shoot with a gas arrow, and because of shooting her with a gas arrow, I didn't check her buddy, that one person is the one who has the freaking office key. Of course. Well. No. Let's see what's in here. that Cetus Amicus Project Cetus that's Project Cetus that's what we've been looking for Chief Engineer Karis page 1 of 21 site Markham's Isle Supervisor Cavador okay maybe this is Markham's Isle and there's a supervisor called Cavador and what is this What? Thou art instructed, though not precisely welcome. Seem not so surprised. Hmm. I have anticipated thine arrival, just as I now anticipate thy departure. Uh, art thou a religious man? It is time to say thy prayers. Thy sins will be thine own undoing. Uh oh. That can't be good. Okay, we might be lucky because I turned that alarm off earlier. Because I do faintly remember. But I might be completely wrong here because it's been such a long time. But, like, I mean, he just said that. Uh, like, are you a religious man and all that definitely sounded like we were about to die now and now nothing happens. I think usually after that recording, the alarm goes off and like everybody in the whole building, if you haven't knocked them out already, is on your track, is trying to kill you. Trying to, yeah, it's, everybody's going after you, whole building filled with, with guards on alert trying to find you. But it's because... This is just my guess now. It's been too long since I played this mission last time. But I think we turned off that alarm. You know the wall save alarm? I mean... That wasn't a wall save, was it? So I'm not entirely sure. But... Yeah, it must have been something like that because... There was no oh. alarm go Oh my god. There was no alarm going off, right? And there should have been. But while that is a bit anticlimactic, then it's all the better for us because it makes our escape easier and less annoying. So let's get the hell out of here. See if I can find the armory on my way back. Just imagine in your own head that I just had an epic escape scene, even though I didn't. Uh, up here? No. Oh, okay. That's the bank. Trying to remember where that armory thing was, but I'm really not sure. And I'm not gonna look through the entire level again. So if I can't find it immediately, then I'll just leave it be. Oh, I like this painting. Always looks so creepy. Well, maybe not creepy, but I don't know. Just. I like it, for some reason. Hm. 
I remember this. That was fun. Just smashing the windows for no particular reason. I like the sound of it, to be honest. Um, that was a bit stupid, though, because I fell down. Oh, well. Is that over there? I'm not sure. Let's have a quick look. Hope I'll careful, careful, don't fall down. Okay, okay. It might have been here. I think. I think I, I, I remember going here and thinking that this is how where I have to go to continue. And then I was like super confused. Oh, come on. Didn't that work? It only work up there. Apparently. Then I was super confused because there was only a locked door. Was that here? It was, wasn't it? Yes. Oh, okay, okay. I'm, I'm excited. It worked. The potion, thanks. Hmm. Okay, it's just stuff. But uh, is that really useful? Because I don't think you take, you carry over whatever you find into the next mission. Hmm. Might not really have been worth it. Well, at least we didn't have to take a huge detour, and now we know what's behind that door. So, so there's that. Okay, careful. No, 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 no! Ah, shit! Again, again. No, careful. I can take this window. <gasps> and now, um, this way, I'm a bit oh, not entirely sure. Hmm. Oh. I thought I saw something. going there. Mm, I see. Close the door, please. Okay. Now I'll go here. Where's this? Oh, okay, I think... I think I know where I am. Hmm. <laughs> yeah. Should be this way to get back to the clock tower. That's a bit too 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 deep. Um, shouldn't jump down there. This way. It's crazy how big and complex this level is, isn't it? No loading screen anywhere. a letter. Use it, please. Thanks. Now we take this window, go down here, go here, and we're almost at the end. <laughs> Leads back to the clock tower over there. I'll fall down now. And we're done. Whew, that was one hell of a mission, wasn't it? Lots of things. Two hours, fifteen minutes. Not too bad. Also found a lot of loot. Still a lot missing, but not too bad. Three secrets out of seven. Whoa. Okay. 
well. Okay. Um, as usual, as a nice little um, you know, teaser, let's check out the next cutscene for the next mission. Even with all we had learned, some events were to prove more complex than we had predicted. The most unlikely of alliances was also the most effective, Chronicle of the Metal Age. I hate to admit it, but you were right about the new scripture of the Master Builder. Karras is up to something, and that book is his master plan. It's too bad he's gone into hiding, or I'd make him eat his words. Karras is fanatical by nature, but now I fear his ambition as well. Please help me. You say he's giving these servants as gifts? Yes, and they must be connected somehow to the scripture. The servants are weapons, and the nobles have just invited them into their homes. I should be so lucky. And the schematics confirm what my agents presumed. Markham's Isle is the staging area for the Cetus Project. You knew about Markham's Isle? Do you know what it took to get into that office? I don't appreciate you wasting my time. You are arrogant, Garrett. Yet, you underestimate your own importance to the cause. Your actions have been invaluable. Do we know what the Cetus Project is? The schematics are too technical to decipher, but the name they reference, Brother Cavador, is the best lead we've had in months. Then we need him. I'm sure you'd love to ask a high-ranking mechanist a few questions. I'll go see if I can't convince Cavador to come back with me. There is much we could learn from him. Lotus, my agent on Markham's Isle, may have information on Cavador, Unfortunately, we've had no word from him for some time. Then he got careless. I won't make the same mistake. I have hoped that Lotus is still alive. He's a faithful agent and a trusted friend. If you could find him, we would be in your debt. I just hope you realize the risks I've been taking for you. It's not every day my services come so cheap. Okay, so it seems we are going to that island in the mission called Precious Cargo. Let's see, what do we have to do? Oh, that's quite the difference. Normal, expert, like just three things and just... Look, bazillion things! One, two, three, four, five, okay, just twice as much, but yeah. Um, expert, kidnap Cavador and return with him to your rowboat find Lotus. He may have some useful information on Cavador. Find and read another passage from the new scripture of the Master Builder. The old lighthouse keeper was quite the sailor in his day. A smuggler friend has commissioned you with finding and stealing the man's antique navigation globe. It should be somewhere in the house. Long before the mechanists took control of Markham's Isle, it was used as a base of operations by a band of pirates led by dark William Markham himself. Rumor has it that Markham left a substantial amount of treasure behind. Find it. Don't kill any mechanists. Mm, that sounds like there might be other things. Like creatures. Yay. And on normal, you just have to kidnap Cavador, find Lotus, and read another passage from the new scripture. But of course we're going to play on an expert, so we have to find these two things as well. We have lots of cash. I just want to have a quick look at the start of the mission. Um, I think moss arrows will be useful again. I do remember there being lots of metal floor. But water arrow, gas arrow would also be cool. But then I would need to buy less of these. I don't have one gas arrow. I would actually like to have two. Fine arrow, I have three. Hmm. I could use another one, I guess. Or breath potion. Nah, healing potion. Get some more water arrows. Then, yeah, that looks nice. Okay, there's our rowboat. Came from there. And. 
What is that? If I were Cavador, where would I be? <laughs> well, let's find out next time. And no, the mission is not a cave mission. This is just the beginning. We just, um, like we rode into some caves uh, at, the, at the bottom of the island, but the, we actually get to the island itself and to the lighthouse and all that. I think it's quite an interesting place. So, yeah, hope to see you, see you there next time, and I hope I won't take forever again to create the next episode, but I should be able to create the next episodes quite soon. So, see you then. Goodbye.